Well, it, it, it's consistent with what he has been doing. He says, if Congress doesn't pass a law regarding immigration like I want, he said this before, then I'll do it myself. And so he stands up, regard, disregards a law that was passed by Congresses before I got here, signed into law by Bill Clinton and others, and says, okay, I'm just going to disregard the law that was passed. Here is the new law. As I speak it, so shall it be. And just speaks new law into existence. I mean, you know, monarchs can do those kind of things, but we're not supposed to have one in the United States. So this wasn't the first time. It's happened before. It's happened on other things, and, and, and not merely on immigration. I mean, we've seen it uh, on Defense of Marriage Act. He refused to defend it. And actually, that was one of the burning issues before the Supreme Court, when the executive branch refuses to defend a law as they're required to do. Is anybody else allowed to actually defend it? And in California, the Supreme Court, of course, that's what made this, this Supreme Court so dishonest here in the last month. On the one hand, they said, OK, when the executive branch and the federal government refuses to defend a law that's passed, uh, then those who passed it can go ahead and defend it. So then they take a, the California case, and I knew, well, I read the Doma case first, so I knew, well, they'll have to apply the same reasonings when the executive branch, California, refused to defend the law. Of course, the, the people that proposed it, pushed it through, and voted for it in the referendum will be able to defend it just as under the same exact reasoning as we had in, in uh, the, the Doma case. And yet they came back and dishonestly, dis, dis, uh, ingenuously, disintelligently came back and said, well, in that one, we're going to say exactly opposite of what we said in the Doma case or in the Prop 8 case. We're going to say the people that passed the law have no standing to defend it. Well, they should have been consistent. That's why I say it was really dishonest, just completely dishonest what they did.